What's up guys, it's your boy Tujir back with another video and today we are playing Dokkan Battle for the very first time. Sort of. So I've done a live stream on this game but I have not done a video of this game yet. And as you can see in the top left hand corner, rank 22, I just started. I've been grinding the story mode a lot. But you guys, I actually asked you guys for some suggestions and some tips in TikTok. Now you guys told me to go through and keep grinding the Bardock event because for new players this gives you all five and you can awaken all of them. And this is a pretty sturdy team overall and pretty much focus on awakening some other characters after I do this like set core of people. Didn't even fight anyone. Wait a minute! So I'm really glad I'm starting to kind of get the hang of all this. Probably should have done that with SSJ4, shouldn't I? Yeah, I was probably should have. That's still a decent amount, though. I didn't get his full max out, but... Oh, no, actually, never mind, because the friend is stronger? No. Actually, no. Either way, this is, this is fine. Kaioken! Okay. Yo, let's fire! I remember watching some videos and people were saying that when Dokkan pretty much first came out, and for a good, like, portion of his actually no i want to I, I want him to go through a good portion of like dokkan in the beginning the animations were not that hot <laughs> let's just say that's what i heard before and maybe that's why it turned me off you know dokkan i did play for quite a bit before but not quite a bit i think i got to like rank i don't know like rank 10 or something i played the like the first few missions in the story mode but I kind of I have a habit of going through and playing games I don't really know what to do on. Kind of just like skipping a lot of stuff and not really paying too much attention to the instructions. So yeah, obviously I'm stupid, my bad. But it just, the game, this aspect of like doing all the orbs and stuff, it just didn't, I don't know, it didn't intrigue me. I still believe Legends is the better game in my personal opinion. I still like Legends more. That's like my baby, you know? That's my, that's my homegrown baby. How do I want to do this? I'll go... I'll go this way, get the item, get the item, get the item, <laughs> training item. And I need to also go through and start doing a lot of these other events that are out. Like there's a ton of events in Dokkan right now apparently, especially for someone that, uh, new to play like me, especially if you're like me where you're fresh, you know, into the game. This is a, this is a lot. But yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to honestly just have a single player game pretty much that I can go through, just kind of chill with and kind of learn the ropes and everything on how this goes. Because it's nice not having a game like Legends only to play where if you get upset and stuff at it, you know, it's pretty much all, a lot of it's wrapped around PvP, especially right now. There's, there's really nothing going on in Legends. It's kind of dry. I mean, we've had a ton of stuff that came out in the last few months, especially all the banners and all the LFs and everything that came out. So we definitely needed a need, need a little bit of a break, to be honest. I also like how in this game, Legend, it's hard to do kind of like dual units, duo units. In this game, it's a lot easier because it's single player. And just looking at that Goku and Vegeta, bro. This year six is coming up. I'm getting into this right before year six. That's crazy. Six years Dokkan has been around. That is absolutely crazy. Good for them. I hope they're around for another six years, to be honest. And I hope Legends last that long, too. To be fair, it is easier to make a game like this last longer than it is for a game like Legends. Because this is, like, we all know, this is single player. And Legends is, its core is based off of multiplayer. Especially in Legends with the... Zenkai is being introduced as pretty much the main factor of the game now, as well as LF's coming out every other week, for the most part. Like, you know, hopefully they finally calm down on that, but having all that at once, man, Legends is in a really bad spot in, like, power creeping-wise, and they gotta chill. They gotta figure something else out, and they just, they gotta chill. They absolutely gotta chill. But yeah, hopefully Legends and Dokkan can both last for a very long time, and I'm hoping that... I can get into let or uh, oh my goodness! You can you do you wait you want? I'm hoping I can get into Dokkan a lot more. Oh, that's dope! 
That's dope. It just did like a little little summary of like what's about to happen. Oh my god. I think this is the last mission. There we go. Oh, okay. He got two attacks off. Yeah, Goku's gonna finish him off. Let's go. Oh, we got Frieza. Okay. Not gonna yo, that's a dope picture of Bardock. Gakarot. Gakarot! Reminds me of Broly. That reminds me of Broly. Zarbon Dodoria. Boring! So this was this is where Bardock goes Super Saiyan pretty much at the end of this because he goes up against Lord Chilled. This should be the end of it, I think. Omega should be able to take care of this. Oh no, he doesn't have a super. Oh yes, he does have a super attack. Okay. All right. Still learning. Still learning. Don't mind me. Oh dear. Oh, you're good. Walk it off, Omega. You didn't die. Oh, he didn't die. All right. That's fine. He's gonna die from this anyways. There you go, buddy. Alright guys, this is going to be the end of the video. I hope you did enjoy. And finally, took me a long time, but finally got some Dokkan content on the channel. If you guys want me to do more Dokkan content, definitely let me know by leaving a like on the video and hitting that subscribe button as well. And turn on that notification bell too. So you know when I post a video, when the second I post it, and also when I go live. It's me, Boy Tooch, guys. I'm out. Be strong. Stay strong. Peace.